Hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm your host and in today's news, Prince Harry and Duchess Meghan Markle are back in the UK after a lengthy hiatus on Vancouver Island in Canada. The pair took six weeks away from royal life to spend time with their family, with close friends and loved ones. They also wanted to spend quality time with their infant son, Archie Harrison, for his first Thanksgiving and Christmas. Now that the pair have returned, they have left all the gossip and negativity surrounding their roles in British royal family in the past. With Prince Andrew on the outs, the Sussexes seem determined to find their footing as senior royals and hopefully mend fences with Prince William and Kate Middleton. The Sussexes' first royal engagement of 2020 was a success. Inside Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's visit to Canada House. To kick off 2020, the Sussex's first royal engagement of the year was to visit Canada House. The Duke and Duchess met with Janice Charrett, High Commissioner in Canada to the UK and her staff. The duo wanted to thank them for their warm Canadian hospitality and support they received during their recent stay in Canada. While visiting Canada House, Markle and Prince Harry also got the opportunity to view an exhibit by Indigenous Canadian artist Saranati. They spoke at length with the High Commission team who work to maintain partnerships between Canada and the UK. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will launch the Sussex Royal Foundation in 2020. In addition to attending to their patronages and solidifying their places in the royal family, the Sussexes will also launch the Sussex Royal Foundation. This has been a highly anticipated move since Markle and Prince Harry split from Prince William and Kate Middleton's foundation in 2019. We await the launch of Harry and Meghan Sussex Royal Foundation to discover their intentions. It all depends on what they mean to do with the Sussex Royal Foundation, where it will be based, what celebrity links there will be, and whether it will have a branch in the USA. They're expected to make their plans clear soon. There are, there are likely to be important celebrity links into their future. Charitable Bullock, such as Harry's collaborating with Oprah Winfrey for a TV documentary series on mental health due to be aired this year. This is why everyone is so obsessed with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's visit to Canada House. In addition, in addition to looking stunning, the Duke and Duchess looked happy and relaxed during their visit. The pair obviously used their time away from the spotlight to connect as a couple because they showed epic displays of PDA during their visit to Canada House. The Sussexes held hands during their visit and Markle was constantly touching her husband's back. Though we doubt they hate, the hateful duo will die down anytime soon, it's nice to see that they focused on other things in 2020. Thank you very much for listening, we'll see you next video.